Copper supply lines are also seen in many houses in the U.S., and if you have it, you'll need a method for cutting it. Brent recommends these simple dial-shaped cutters. They're great to use in tight spaces, and they work similarly to the PVC cutter. They come in three-quarter inch and half inch diameters, the most common residential supply line sizes. And some, like this rigid, are multi-cut, so they can be toggled between the two. To operate them, you just snap them into place, and a spring load on the tooth prevents them from falling off or moving. So, as you rotate, the spring applies the pressure to the cutting wheel. With each pass, you can see it scoring the soft copper. It's also incrementally beveling both ends of the cut as it turns. Eventually, the pieces snap apart from the scoring, and you have two nearly perfect ends. They'll just have to be deburred before they're installed to cut down on turbulence in the pipe. 